Hey, hey, welcome back to Devious Spotlight. That's right, today I'm showing off the 65 Lincoln Continental of Jesse Chavez. Hold on, how are we doing? Good friend of mine for five, 10 years now. What's going on? Better I have no idea. 10, right? <laughs> yeah. I met Jesse yeah. and uh, uh, I didn't know what he did or who he is or whatever. Uh, I got his car through another person, we airbagged it, and we just did kind of a simple job and got it out. And uh, then we, we kind of met up and started talking a little bit and then kind of grew from there. We added this and added that. And mm -hmm. now his car is like pretty sick. I mean, it's, it, I love it, it's, a, it's a head turner for yeah. sure. Uh, yep. So it's a matte red finish that we did. Uh, we did an LS swap, but we didn't stop there. We uh, went ahead and put a turbo on it. So I think we dynoed it at 550 horsepower to the rear wheels. And when I did have my dyno guy do it, I told him, don't torture it. I want it reliable. Yeah. <laughs> Jesse has this uh, funk with this car where uh, every so often the key won't work or the battery will die or something funny. So I'm like, this thing has to be 100% reliable because yeah. I don't want to call I don't want to call from Jesse. Yeah. <laughs> so um, it's on 20 inch Detroit steel wheels. It's got R4 air ride suspension. Uh, we ended up doing our upper and lower control arms. Uh, we did a stereo system in it that is off the hook, and we did put a little something extra special in there for Jesse. Uh, and I'm gonna show you that now. <laughs> so in the trunk here, we built a speaker box that the subs fire right at the back seat, but uh, we also made a little storage compartment for cleaning stuff or whatever he wants to take with him, coolers or luggage or whatever, if he's gonna do a day trip. Amplifiers on one side, air rides on the other. Uh, and then we did a little special compartment here. As you can see, there's nothing in there right now, but you, you can kind of guess what goes, in, what goes in there. Jesse's like me, we like to go out shooting and uh, definitely like to keep our stuff concealed and hidden. So, so in the interior, uh, it's pretty much stock. It's just super clean. Um, I think we ended up redoing the seats, didn't we? Yes, we did. We did the yeah, seats. they're cracking a little bit too much. Yeah, the seats and I think the door panels. And then um, we put our audios in the door, of course. Uh, to make the sound system come together. We also did a Dakota Digital in the dash that uh, keeps all the heartbeat alive when you uh, go down the road. And the yeah. gas gauge works. Yep, gas gauge, yeah. <laughs> when I first met him, he's like, all I really want is this damn gas gauge to work. <laughs> that was the biggest thing. <laughs> um, it does have our devious fuel tank in it uh, with the uh, fuel injection pump inside it. So on the LS motor, we did Phytech injection. We have a comp turbo, uh, aluminum radiator, a 4L60E, we beefed it up a lot because with the torque and the performance that this thing pushes out, it was it would, it'll just spit spit through a, four, four, a stock 4L60E. So, and uh, we had that all dialed in, new drive shaft. So the car is like super solid. I mean, this is something that I wouldn't be afraid to get in and drive anywhere. The first time I saw the car was black, and it was in pretty good shape. I think uh, if I remember right, you just had it painted before I got it. Yeah, yeah. It was uh, matte black before that, and I just got it painted gloss black. Gloss black. Yep. And then. Uh, we uh, did the airbags and stuff, we got it back for a while, then we we, uh, we wrapped it in a army green flap, which yeah. was epic, mm -hmm. but over time, you know, wraps start giving out and all that stuff, so uh, Jesse came to me with like, hey, let's do flat, like a maroon or a flat red, do some spray outs, and we end up painting it this color now, and I think it's actually probably the best paint that's held up on this car since yeah. the 17 different colors is that. Oh, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. Mm -hmm. It'll last the longest, that's for sure. Yeah. I don't think I'm gonna change anytime soon. No. It fits the name. I love it. What's the name of it? Roxanne. Roxanne. Nice. So for you guys that don't know, Jesse's a pro baseball player. He plays for the Texas Rangers. Rangers, right? Okay. I I only say that hesitantly because you've seen him switch teams a few times the last few years. Yeah, so. I tend to move around. <laughs> around so. He's played for the Dodgers, the Angels, the Cubs, Pirates, Royals, all how, over. How awesome is that, though? Like to do what you do and go to all these stadiums and all these people watching you. And oh, it's, it's a blessing. I mean, think about 20 years ago, I never thought I'd have been in this position at all. Yeah. Just a skinny little kid from Fontana, not even <laughs> having an inkling of what Major League Baseball would bring Absolutely. To the table for, for my family. Absolutely. So. And a great family you have, man. This is just super cool. Um, and again, like getting to know you, you know, we've done a few projects. We've got a couple more coming down the pipe right now but you're so humble and so cool. And like, you. we and you chit chat all the time on text message and phone calls and every now and then have a beer. So I just want to thank you for being a customer. I appreciate it. And thank you for letting me build your dream. Appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> Can't wait to drive it some more. All right. So don't forget to subscribe. That's the button there. Like, follow, tell your friends, leave comments. Hell, I don't know. Tell us how we're doing, please. Thank you. Have a good one.